Uh, today we're going to talk about the movie Cleopatra, and we're going to look at it from maybe a different perspective. Uh, at the time, Elizabeth Taylor asked for a million dollars, and the powers that be said, well, that's too much. What year was this? This was probably 61, 62, because the movie is, is labeled 63, but it took a while to make. So they said, um, she, she counter-offered them at 750000 and they said, okay. But she said, if this goes beyond the beyond the the, uh, the parameter for putting it in the can, then, then you're going to have to pay a regular salary. So what happened was she got sick. That put, put the, the thing behind schedule. They also had made all the, the big statues and the, and the sets. They did it in the, in the United Kingdom where it's always um, kind of rainy and cloudy and stuff, and this is a... Uh, Egypt, where it's always sunny, so they had to rebuild everything back in, uh, I think, on the continent of France or so, and so that, that put it behind schedule. So long story short, after the thing finally got made, I think they had to pay her, I don't know, I'm out on a limb here, but maybe around $8 million, maybe $7 million. so there was talk about bankrupting the studio and so forth, that's where it went. So she picked Rex, she picked Rex Harrison for his his part in uh, in Caesar, and that's just a couple of the the interesting things. And then of course her and and Burton had more of a public romance. Uh, he played Mark Antony, and uh, it's it's a fabulous movie, and it's just got a lot lot going going for it. I don't think they could could produce something like that today, with. Uh, with any kind of budget, and it was just kind of an interesting fact that just many people don't don't know that or don't really care about it or aren't interested in it, whatever. But it just goes to show you that what be hap what hap what can happen and what did happen behind the scenes. So I thought, you know, it's her as a human being. She was kind of scrutinized pretty closely. Um, but here, if you look at her as a businessman, a business person, uh, uh, she made a, 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 some pretty astute moves there, if you ask me. It's really, really brilliant. And uh, a lot of times the, the studios will, it'll be the other way around. The actor won't get paid quite as much as they're worth or so forth. But, but uh, and maybe they won't get anything on the back end or whatever is involved with it. But. Uh, I, I really felt that was something on her part, and uh, I really admire her for that. So I'll sign off for now on that one. Okay, producer. And she picked he Rex Harrison, by the way. She picked him for his part. And uh, so I'll sign off on this one for now. <laughs>